Huge limestone blocks, locally quarried and weighing several tons, make up the front half of Khafre's pyramid temple. The building is the first to contain all five of the elements that were to become standard for Old Kingdom Royal pyramid temples. An entrance hall, broad columned court, five niches, five storage chambers, and a sanctuary. This temple was cased with granite blocks from Aswan at Egypt's southern border. As you entered the temple from the long causeway, two granite rooms appeared on the south, and a corridor led to four alabaster-lined chambers to the north. A stairway here provided access to the roof. Granite columns supported the next two halls, the first running north to south, with a series of recesses leading westwards. Perhaps very large statues of the king stood in the long east-west corridors off of either side of this first pillared hall. Khafre's statues were all recycled for other purposes in later times, so we have very few remains here. This is very different from all the statue fragments found in his valley temple. The second pillared hall is oriented east to west. It opens onto a large court cased in granite in the center of the temple. The alabaster floor held 12 granite statues of the king, either seated or standing. We may still have some of these re-inscribed in the New Kingdom for Ramses II and set into emplacements in the floor. It's possible that inscriptions or wall scenes once decorated this part of the temple. To the west of the great court, five long niches might once have housed ritual mortuary boats of Khafre, or perhaps more statues. Five smaller magazines are visible behind the larger five niches. The sanctuary was at the very back of the temple, up against the east face of the pyramid. It might have contained a false door niche, in the northwest corner of the temple, a corridor opened into the enclosure area of the pyramid itself. The design of the inner courts of both this temple and the Sphinx temple are nearly identical. This is additional evidence for assigning the Sphinx temple to the reign of Khafre.